Friday lights help brighten the night sky, but they can also make your electric bill go sky high. Newswatch 16's John Hickey has tips on how to stay festive while saving money on your bill in this week's Power to Save. It's that time of year. Holiday light displays are popping up in neighborhoods here and all across northeastern and central Pennsylvania. Honey, I think I know what's wrong. They look great, but that electric bill Grinch always catches up with us at the end of the month. PPL Regional Affairs Director Alana Roberts has some ideas to help you lower your electric bill this holiday season. I think the first thing to do is when you're pulling your uh, decorations out of storage to inspect them. So if you see any frayed wires or broken bulbs or loose connections, ditch those. Upgrading your older light displays with new ones will go a long way in lowering your electric bill. LED lights are 75% more efficient than incandescent bulbs. Um, they last a lot longer because they're more durable, so they don't have any filaments that could break, and they're even safer because they don't heat up like incandescents. One strand of LED lights will cost less than a dollar to run for the whole season. Another energy saving idea? Once you go to hang them up, certainly one of the most thing, uh, energy efficient things you can do is set them on a timer. Those blinking bulbs? aren't a bad thing. If your lights blink, I don't know if people know this, but um, if they blink at certain intervals, that'll also save money too. So that's kind of some additional savings. If you don't want to deal with all the hazards that come with putting up lights all over your house or using that extra energy, you could always come to a local park and enjoy the light display. They always do a fabulous job here at Nayog Park and, and I'll be here a few nights this uh, winter myself. With this week's Power to Save, John Hickey, Newswatch 16, Scranton. I agree with her. The lights are always.